In this video, I want to demonstrate how you can add more life into programmed MIDI drum parts. And I'm going to do that using the pencil tool. So here I have a drum beat that sounds like this. Okay, so you notice it sounds really stale and boring because the hi-hat's constantly playing at the exact same velocity. So it's common that drummers will accent the downbeats on the hi-hat or accent every other hi-hat note. And I want to incorporate that into this drum groove. So to do that, I first need to select my hi-hat notes. And then I'm going to go up to the pencil tool. And I want to choose the triangle shape. And because I've selected the hi-hat notes, now when I drag across the velocity view, you'll see it'll only affect the selected notes. Now I want to accent the downbeats, and so this looks pretty good here. And we're going to go ahead and play this back. Okay, and I'm going to increase the velocity just a little bit. Great, and this can also sound really good on open hi-hat. All right, so let me show another situation. Here I've got a build-up part where I have the snare drum playing constant 16th notes, and I want this to build into the next section. And it currently sounds like this. Okay, really boring again and stale. I'm going to go back to using the pencil tool, but I first want to highlight the snare drum, go to the pencil tool, and I'm going to choose eighth notes so that the shape occurs for every eighth note. And I'm going to click and drag across these notes. And again, I'm, I'm dragging up and down to find how I would like the accents to land as far as the beats go, and I want it to land on the downbeats. So I want something about like this, and I'm going to go ahead and play this beat back. It sounds like this. Okay, so already way better. And so what I want to have happen is I want to maintain this pattern, but I want it to build from left to right. So to do that, I'm going to go to Event Operations, and I'm going to do that by right-clicking in the background and choosing Event Operations, Change Velocity, and then in this window, I'm going to choose Change Smoothly by Percentage, and I'm choosing the settings from 80% to 145%. I'm going to hit Apply, and this is how it sounds. <laughs> 